Mindset and Value Basis for ESD Schools Vision and Mission Welcome to our video, Exploring the Role of Mindset and Values in Shaping a School's Vision and Mission for Sustainable Development. It is intended to serve as inspiration for you to promote ESD in your school and daily classroom practice. We know so many things but we don't know ourselves. Meister Eckhart Please take a moment. Read the quote again and reflect on it. If you are a teacher interested in fostering student motivation, you may already know about Carol Dweck's Mindset Theory, 2006. Students' beliefs about intelligence can shape their motivation and behavior in the classroom. Dweck and her colleagues have shown that students who endorse a so-called growth mindset Perceiving intelligence as a changeable trait that can be improved through hard work, persistence, help-seeking, and adopting good strategies, tend to be more motivated, persistent, and better performing in school than students who endorse fixed mindset beliefs, assuming that intelligence is innate and largely unchangeable. Again, take a moment to have a closer look at the picture. So, you want to help your pupils develop a growth mindset? Here are some suggestions. Spread messages about success, for example, it may be challenging, but all of you can do well if you work hard, seek help, and try different learning strategies. Provide opportunities for practice and feedback, like, please come to my office hours, we can review your exam together. Respond to pupils' struggle in a supportive way, like, mistakes are opportunities to learn, try thinking about the problem this way instead place value on student learning and development, for example, the process you use to reach the answer is more important than the end result, you should be proud of your hard work and how much you've learned this year. Now that we understand the concept of mindset, let's take it a step further and explore what a sustainability mindset looks like. The concept of a sustainability mindset developed by Isabel Romanoxi is a way of thinking and being which results from a broad understanding of the ecosystem, social sensitivity, and an introspective focus on personal values and the higher self. It finds its expression in actions for the greater good. Individuals learn to notice the lens through which they see the world and are able to revise it. It can be used as a personal development tool to support the shift toward a more encompassing and conscious mindset. The sustainability mindset consists of 12 principles and the corresponding four content areas, ecological worldview, systems perspective, emotional intelligence and spiritual intelligence. For each content area we would like to give you an example of one principle. Ecological worldview. Ecoliteracy. Investigate with your students the state of the planet including environmental and social challenges, for example via scientists for future podcasts or current articles. Systems Perspective Both and thinking, help students understand paradoxes and strive for creative solutions that involve all stakeholders, for example via role-play games. Emotional Intelligence Self-awareness Make your students explore their personal values, beliefs, assumptions, and motivations, to gain greater control over their actions and see new and alternative behaviors. For example by working with the distinction between factual knowledge and value-based opinions, and investigate the values and interests behind them. Spiritual Intelligence Purpose Support your students in defining their purpose, in life. This provides an unconscious compass, and when it is grounded in values of our higher self, we actively shape a better world. But what are the most important values when we are talking about sustainability? The European Sustainability Competence Framework Green Comp defines embodying sustainability values as the first of four competence areas. It encourages us to reflect on and challenge our own personal values and worldviews. And this should happen in terms of unsustainability, 
sustainability values and world views. This area advocates equity and justice for current and future generations and preservation and restoration of nature as main sustainability values. When learners are encouraged to reflect and question knowledge acquisition, assimilate it, and put it into practice, transformative learning takes place. Such learning involves cognitive, head, psychomotor, hands, and affective, heart, domains. The following three competencies are suggested by Green Comp. First, valuing sustainability. Second, supporting fairness. Third, promoting nature. Valuing sustainability means for example to contemplate what impact buying fast fashion or taking a flight for a weekend getaway have at system level. Supporting fairness could be fostered by reflecting with your pupils the global distribution of money and resources. You can also use statistics and maps like GDP per capita, 2021, ourworldindata.org. Promoting nature can be implemented by getting outside with your students and explore the woods, meadows and rivers near your school to help your students build a relationship with nature. There are plenty of resources regarding outdoor education and forest pedagogy. The school's vision outlines its core purpose, values and objectives. On the other hand, the school's mission explains what the school is currently doing to achieve its vision. To successfully integrate ESD at school, the school's vision and mission should align with ESD principles and values. Now, Please reflect on your own school's vision and mission. If you want, take some notes or discuss with your colleagues. Please pause the video. The schools you saw in the inspirational video are showcases for successfully integrating sustainable values into school life. In order to create a common understanding of the school's vision and mission in relation to ESD, it is suggested to develop it together with the whole school team in a participatory way and communicate it internally and externally to the school. It is also recommended to form an ESD school team to share responsibilities. There are national and international ESD labels and networks for schools that offer support and exchange on various levels that you can join. For example, the Eco School Network, Greenpeace Schools for Earth, International the Ökolog network in Austria, and so forth. We hope we could encourage you to integrate ESD values into everyday teaching by reflecting on your own mindset and commitment to ESD. Have fun implementing ESD values in your school life.